Hi everyone, this is Mary, you're watching Cards TV, and I can't believe it's been a year since the last 12 Days of Christmas card series, and it's time for another one for 2010, and this is the uh, first card in the series, this is card number one, and it was inspired by this paper pack I got at Joann's the other day. It has such beautiful papers in it and they have such rich beautiful colors and I really like the combination of the uh, chocolate brown and the beige and the red I just think it has a very rich look to it so we're gonna uh, go ahead and make this card today but let me show you some of these papers I hope you can see them I'll tilt it up isn't that cute? It's got the little birds and the music and the Christmas trees. I just love it. It has kind of a country look to it. Let's see how many of them I can show you. This is a green and white polka dot. Look at this. Wouldn't that be cute for a scrapbook page with the little bird and the music? And look at this. I love this with the little birds on there and the little buttons love it look at that flat I really like it and this is like uh, little tags you can cut out if I can get over here to it here we go see it's got tags it's got journaling blocks so you can use this for scrapbooking or for putting on your gifts there's just really some cute papers wouldn't that be cute on a scrapbook page I love this one with the mittens and the skates and the sleds. There's just tons. Look at this gingham. Now this is one I chose for the card. So let me get my adhesive and get everything ready and we'll go ahead and make one of these cards. My card base is four and a quarter by five and a half and it opens this way and this is kind of a cream colored card stock. I have a red mat which is four by five and a quarter then I have this uh, snowflake mat like you see right here and it's three and three quarters by five and then over on the side we're going to put this mat which is I cannot remember I didn't write it down <laughs> this one is two and a half by three and three quarters and it's going to layer over here on the side then I have some ribbon that's going to go right down where the papers come together and it'll have a bow on top and I used winter woodland to cut out this red scallop and this beige circle and this is all on the same page with the snowflake. This is my favorite snowflake in this cartridge. And this is on page 32. And I cut the uh, scallop. I actually cut this one right here under shadow blackout. Cut it in red at two and a half. Came over here and cut my circle out of the cream colored cardstock also at two and a half. And what I did for the snowflake. I wanted to have the brown polka dot snowflake, but the paper's kind of thin, so I also cut one to adhere it to out of the cream colored cardstock, and this was also cut at two and a half. Then down here, I had a little stamp that said Happy Holidays, and I couldn't stamp it on this paper because it wouldn't show up, so I just stamped it on some of the cream colored cardstock. And then I mounted it on some of the red, and it's going to tuck right up under there. Here's my bow for the top. And I found some tiny little buttons the other day when I got the uh, card stack, or paper stack, excuse me, at Joann's. These are tiny little buttons, and I just thought they looked so cute on there. There's a darker one inside the snowflake, one down here, and three here. So let me get my adhesive. I'm still not using my ATG gun. I'm still having some problems with it. So I'm using this one for right now. But I will get that ATG gun up and running again. Because I like that thing. So 
we're going to go ahead and get this adhered down. It's a pretty quick little card. So you could mass produce these if you needed to. I just really like the look of the tapers together. Now we're not going to adhere this one on yet, but we are going to put this on the side because we want to wrap the ribbon around here. So we'll get this on. Kind of having one of those days where I'm all thumbs. Do you ever have those? I haven't slept very well lately. I've just been so busy. When I finally do try to go to sleep, I'm too tired. Okay, now that will go on like that, but first we're going to wrap our ribbon around, and you know I like to just put some glue on it. Makes it nice and easy. We'll just center it right on here. See, I told you I'm all thumbs. And then it's got glue so we can just wrap it around the back. And that looks straight. So now we can adhere it on our red. See, it's looking like that one. And I'm going to go ahead and put this circle on my red scallop. When you get everything cut out, you can have kind of like an assembly line. It goes pretty fast. Now we're going to put this on some uh, either foam tape or some pop dots. And we're going to glue these together with our two-way glue pen, which I don't have, so I'm going to have to run and get that. And then we're going to put this on Pop Dots on top of this. So I'm going to run and get my two-way glue pen. I'll be right back. Okay, I went ahead and used my two-way glue pen to put my snowflake together. And I've got some Pop Dots on the back. And if I can get the paper off, we'll go ahead and put it on our scallop and circle. These are tiny little pop dots. I found a package. I was going through one of my drawers looking for something and I found them. And I thought, well, I need to use those. And we'll go ahead and line this up on here. Try to get it in the center. And then we're going to take this little tiny brown button and put it on a glue jaw and put it in the center of the snowflake. I can get it in the center. Yep, I did. And we've got two more of the pop dots on the back. These are a little bit bigger ones. And we'll go ahead and put this on our card. And we're going to try to center it as well. Okay. And we'll put a glue dot on our bow and put it on. As you can see, I went ahead and added the bow to the top and the three buttons here and the one down here with the sentiment. And now I have two cards for Christmas already. So this is the first card in the series, the 12 Days of Christmas Cards, card number one. Thanks so much for coming by today, guys, and I'll see you again really soon. Bye now. Mm -hmm.